ladies if your man wanna get buck wild just go back and leave him on style put your hands in his cash and spend it for the last time all of the hard time oh when you go and everything goes from script to this right on clothes so you better let him know that if you mess up you gonna hit him up oops okay 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 guys it's your girl alice and you're welcome to my channel i'm sure you're wondering why am i singing heartbreak or leaving a guy song yes but be because today i'm going to be telling you 10 signs why you should leave your man in 2019 if he is still doing these things if he's still doing some annoying things that you've been talking 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 about and is refusing to change i think it's time to change him so guys in this video i'm going to be telling you 10 things why you should 10 things why you should leave your man in 2019. number one if he refuses to change there is something he has been doing you have been talking 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 since the morning i don't like when you do this i don't like you doing this please change especially when you know it's not something that you're being selfish about something that is deliberately affecting the both of you my dear, maybe it's time to leave his ass in 2019. Number two, if he is a liar, you can never get truth. The only time he says the truth is when he tells you, baby, good morning. In fact, at times you have to look at the time to see if it's truly morning. He does not say the truth. He is a big liar. Please leave his ass in 2019. Number three, if he has infidelity issues, he cannot close his eyes from one woman from close his eyes when he sees anything in skirt from one pants to another from another skirt to another skirt and he's disgracing you about it. everybody's telling you ah your husband oh girl i saw him with Fadeke yesterday i saw him with shalewa i saw him with this i saw him with that and you're talking you're talking you're talking he's not refusing to change my sister pack your teeth and run is it until he gives you hiv or some stds before you will now know that ah um Oh, uh, and I was there for him and he gave me STDs. My sister run away. I know some of you will be wa watching and saying, Kilo she, what is wrong with her? What about the next guy she's going to meet? Are you sure he's not going to be the same thing? At least you want to give yourself a benefit of doubt. Run away. You will catch HIV, my sister. And for the fact that he's living with anything in scared, he doesn't love you. Don't let him, don't agree or believe that you say ah, it's a man's word. Men are wired like that. Who told you we, we are not wired like that? Most women, trust me. We are tired of your ass already and your weaker sex. But we just manage you and take it because of love, because of the vow, because of trust. That is why we are taking it. So why can't you do the same? Anyways, number three, if he's a people pleaser and he's not so with you. For instance, you see how he tries to please people when they call him on for please I need this. He does not have money, but he'll say, Okay, and um, I want to do this. Please can I come and stay in your place for some days? And he's like, Yes, but with you, he's not that way. He doesn't try to please you. He does not try to make you feel happy. He doesn't go out of his way to please you. My brother, sister, maybe you are not his priority. You should think of leaving. Yes. You should think of leaving if he's not trying to make you happy but everybody that comes his way he's trying to be mr nice guy everybody outside will be like oh my god why is your husband so nice oh my god i wish i was with someone like that but deep down in your heart you're like hmm, he's just nice to you to you guys he's not that same way with me maybe just maybe he needs space just maybe he needs space you should just walk away if he doesn't give you quality time you don't get to see any time you see you don't get to see him every time you want even when you think he should he rather hang out with his boys the only time he can call you is when he sends you a message in the midnight what are you doing you know he wanna he wanna smash that's the only time he has time for you but anything apart from pedmatics he doesn't have your time he doesn't take you out he doesn't take it and yet he knows all the whole nice restaurants in lagos you see his instagram he'll be located putting location chilling with this chilling with that but he doesn't give you that same time maybe he doesn't like you or maybe he just likes the sex and you should talk to your brain and move the next one if he's lazy and what he bothers about is his sex game some guys will not wake up in the morning and say, okay, let me look for how I'll hustle for my, my baby or how I'll hustle for my family or how I'll hustle for myself. They will even clean. They cannot do anything in the house. All they do is they sit in front of the system, play Game Boy, play um, one PS, whatever. 
PS 1 million, they do whatever they want to do. When it's time to dress up, they have money will come out, they'll go to the barber, give them mad ass friction, I've got this to call it. They are side beds, everything's on fleek. They even have bed oil. They are they have all the whole designers. Anytime they want to do a shabby, they can afford to bring that money for that, they are useless for that but but when it comes to taking care of the house, they will not have money. It's very lazy. You say, ah, babe, there's this interview I want you to go and let us, ch um, there's this interview I want you to go. Ah, no, I'm done with employment. What I want to do now is business. Once I'm able to hit one big money like this, I open. They have big dreams, but they are more, but their dreams, their, their mouth is not matching their work. They are not ready to work hard. My sister, run for your life. If you know you love yourself, pick up your shoes dust it and run away a lazy man will just kill you you just age the next one if he's a manipulator they know how to make you feel like you're the one that is doing something bad even when they are wrong they'll make you apologize then they are never wrong in their own lifetime you are always the one that will be wrong my sister a man that is manipulating you does not love you pick your leg and run they are the ones that will tell you that ah, no i don't like you to be with this friend though don't stay with this friend she'll be the one that they don't want you they want you to themselves so that they can be able to manipulate you without people noticing that's how they are you remember r kelly that's what he does he will isolate you they will isolate you from people that you love the most so that they can be able to manipulate you run away from such man he doesn't love you if he's abused the next one is if he's abusing you physically and emotionally before you say do re me i slap your mouth before you say ah, ah, what did i do to be here ah and if you tell this one now to go to wrestling, he cannot fight. He cannot beat his fellow men. It's women that has, it's around women that he has energy. Run away from such man. A man does not even have to beat you physically. There's a way he can beat you emotionally that is worse. Does not make you feel enough. Every time you wear something, it's not beautiful. He appreciates other women. You see him on Instagram, beautiful, commenting on other women, but he has never opened his mouth and say, Ah, my wife is. That's why I like social media love. Yes, they say it's not good, but if you love somebody, you will post their picture because you know you are proud about, proud of them. Put your wife's picture. Put your girlfriend, boyfriend's picture. Put their picture out. If you know you are proud, proud of them, comment on their pictures. Let them feel loved when they wear something nice. Show what them with praises, not that the one that he just keeps abusing you emotionally does not make you feel enough. When you look at the mirror, instead of seeing a very beautiful, vibrant young woman, you see yourself as ugly because he tells you you are ugly, he tells you you are shapeless, he tells you you are too dark, he tells you you are too yellow, he tells you you are too skinny. Has he even looked at himself in the mirror? My sister, if you are with such man, run away because there is nothing you will ever do that will be enough. Nothing run away from such man if he's abusing you emotionally and physically or physically because they are not mutually together if it continues to make you cry some men love it when they see their wife crying for them they'll be like ah and the man she cries for me because she loves me no a man who loves you doesn't want to see tears from your eye even out of see my partner when i am sad and he sees that my eyes is going red. He tries to just, even if at that point he knows he's making sense, he just stops talking because he doesn't want to see me cry. And that is what is important. How can a man that claims to love you be watching you be crying? Please don't do it again. Stop cheating on me. Why? This one, you are losing weight. You are looking sad and he's still doing the same thing. And you claim he loves you. How? I'm sure your mother will be there saying, I did not teach my child this. Even if. You watched your mother take all of this from their father. Now is the right time for you to make changes because you see how far it has gotten. You don't want to do the same thing to your own child. So if he keeps making you cry every time and enjoys it, please run away. The last one, if he is not making concrete plans in marrying you. You are together in the same city. It's not like you could have a distance, a long distance relationship or there's distance or you could have nothing. He's here. He has enough money to take care of the family. He's doing well. You two are doing well. You have enough money. Things are going on well. He has a house. He has a car. Everything is going on well. And yet he has not said he wants to marry. But yet every Friday he'll come and pick you. You will go home. You will go to market. Cook soup. You will see. Wash his clothes. Mop the floor. Do this. Do that. Then in the night he will pound out the living death of your body. And he's not talking about marriage. People are just enjoying your life. You are just bawling and deep down in your heart you want to get married. It's not like you are agreeing with the arrangement. My sister, then leave the relationship. 
year one year two he has not said i want to marry you he has not introduced you to his parents his parents has not come to see your own parent okay let's say for instance now okay maybe you put have plans in place and his parents has come officially to visit your parents and brought drink to say ah there's something we saw in this family that we want to uh -huh. but he's not saying any of that you don't even know any of his real the only people you know are his friends and his friends are his enablers because trust me they know the people that he's serious with and they will still be calling you yeah, well, how oh god thunder will fire any man any friend of my of of any of in fact let me do swear on on youtube but really what are you doing with him he's not having plans for marriage he will take you he's taking you out showing everybody making people think that you have somebody serious in your life but deep down in his heart he does not even have plans for you my sister my sister pick up your two legs and leave that relationship he's not serious so guys what are the other things you think i have not mentioned why you should leave him in 2019 feel free to comment and i will reply everybody in the video and um this is where i round up the video i hope you learned a thing or two um if you are the if you, this is your first time watching me or joining us on my channel you are very much welcome feel free to subscribe and then um, please put on your notification bell so you'll be prompted when i upload a new video so this is where i round out the video like i said earlier and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys Mwah.